Pinderella's pass completely. Incomplete, broken up by Illinois. 
The gorilla's pass is complete.
time is set by Lane Mixon. Pass complete to Celestine. Hans <laughs> pass complete to Corrales for a touchdown. Jace was from Gridiron Football. I'm here with uh, Victoria's head coach, Andy Moran from U-High, along with his uh, star running back here tonight, Corbin O'Dell. And, uh, Coach, you really leaned tonight on your big offensive line, on Corbin, on Sage Ingram. Just what you had to say about really the ground ground attack and really leaning on that tonight. Yeah, they did a great job. The O-linemen were opening the holes, and, and our running backs were hitting it hard. And, and they, yeah, they showed what we can do, you know, and it was fun to see. And uh, Corbin, what was like to get your name called fourth down? You need it fourth and goal. They give you the football, and you found your way in the end zone. Uh, I feel happy as well, man. I just been following my blacks. I got to follow my blacks. That's what everybody's telling me. I've just been doing what they told me. Because when they coach me as a sophomore, first on varsity, you know, it's a lot of them to learn. They need to help me. And uh, Corbin, how did you and Sage just compliment each other? Oh, man. It was amazing. It was beautiful. I wish you could have scored him though. So. <laughs> yeah, Sage got you down there and you finished the deal. Uh, coach, defensively, that's a good offense y'all played tonight. That's a good quarterback y'all played tonight. Um, so what were some I guess, keys to success on that for the defensive side to be thought, able to have the success y'all had? I thought about a lot of pressure on him. Uh, we didn't let him just sit there and throw. You know, early on we kind of did, and then we realized that we could kind of get to him. So we started, we started seeing a little bit of pressure, which kind of got him off off his throwing lanes and, 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 and pressure just to throw a little bit. We haven't stopped the run, which they, they run the ball really well. Mm -hmm. And that was a big thing for us, stop the run. Make them throw, and I thought we did that well. You know, special teams got you that boost early on with a big Keelan Moses fake punt. Um, so, uh, also, have you got a chance to talk to Keelan yet, or uh, just any? No, I haven't got any updates yet. We'll find out. We're hoping it's not too serious, so we'll find out. Absolutely. And uh, coaches, overall thoughts on the win? Just find kind of you're gritting your way. Could have been more on the points being scored with the two turnovers. Yeah, I mean we had three turnovers. Three two turnovers going into the end zone, you know, so that that, that uh, definitely left some points on the board. However, our guys stayed resilient even with all that. Kept playing hard. And I'm just proud of. Them. And uh, what you had to say about uh, about Corbin right here and uh, his potential as a Corbin, up and coming running back. Doing a great job. I mean, just got to keep. Uh, Keep learning our system. Keep doing what we need him to do. Him and Sage, both, they complement each other very well. And last question, Coach, moving forward, what's just kind of like the, the message to the team and another important win for y'all, just building on that? Oh, we should clean up turnovers. I mean, mm -hmm. clean up turnovers and, and, and stay away from the penalties like I thought we did a good job of tonight and keep playing good defense and we'll see how far we can take us. Absolutely, Coach. Congratulations to you and Cor Corbin on a great performance. Thanks.